Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Welcome my fellow cap cutters. Today we're gonna be talking about using avatars in cap cut, which is a hot feature as you can see here. And what can you do? You can engage your audience with desired avatars and there's just a lot of them now in CapCut. While we are using the CapCut on the web, this is the browser, this is not the app. And what you want to do is make sure that you are logged into your CapCut and that you go to create with AI right here so that you can get to avatars. Now, if you go under all, you'll still see it, but you just have to go through everything here. But a quick way to get to that is just to go to create with AI and you are right there. And what we're looking for again are avatars. So once you select avatar, a timeline opens up as you can see here. And it already has an avatar here, as you can see, which is it's Nadia in front of the dressing table. So as you can see here, Nadia is our talking avatar. There are a host of them over here on the left, as you can see, just a bunch of them. And we'll go through a few of them so you can know exactly how to use them. So we have Nadia in front of the dressing table. This is how you can get to this information here. And that's who's been placed here. So what are we going to do? We're going to play Nadia so you can hear what she says. Welcome to Cap. Cut Commerce Pro, let's create something amazing together. Wow. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro, let's create something amazing together. So she's saying the same thing because it's the same word. So what we're going to do here is let's see, we like this, that's pretty cool. Let's just check out another AI avatar here and let's delete Nadia. And let's see here what she's going to say. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro, let's create something amazing together. That's pretty cool, I like that almost welcome to cap cut commerce pro let's create something amazing together a little more believable than nadia is what i would say so the thing you're starting to see here and what i noticed right off the bat is that some avatars will seem to say the words better i think it also depends on the text you know based on how their mouths welcome have been to programmed cap cut commerce pro let's create something amazing together you could see nadia's mouth compared to, to cap cut commerce pro let's create something amazing together so that's the first thing you want to look out for is which one really is saying what you want to hear let's go to asha here let's see what asha says she is in front of the dressing table let's see welcome to cap cut commerce pro let's create something amazing together wow like now that's like clear welcome to CapCut commerce all right pro. let's create something this amazing is together. welcome to cap cut commerce pro let's create something amazing together. welcome to cap cut commerce pro let's create something amazing together wow welcome to i gotta say asha in front of the dressing table is really hitting it okay let's look at jabari right here so we're just going through all these AR characters. The way to add them, as you can see, is to simply go there and click on the avatar and it just automatically goes into the timeline. Let's check it out. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. All right. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing. All right, so I'm gonna go in here. Now, if you wanna change the text, it's very simple. You just click on the frame. You click on the video right here. And you go and go to the narration. Narration here says, welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something together. So let's even try BizCrow Media and see what happens because BizCrow Media is just not a common word in the dictionary. And let's see how Asha pulls that one off so i'm gonna hit apply if you want to change it you come in here you change the text you have up to a thousand i get this all the time like oh i, I it's not taking all my script as you can see it's a thousand characters you can't do any more than that and you'll have to double it up if you do want to do that and when i mean double it up is you would apply this here and then create another scene and write something totally different in here so that you could join them together all right, let's apply now and see if Asha in front of the dressing table can actually pronounce BizCrown Media. And you hit apply, it says generating speech. And we're picking Asha because out of all the characters we've used, the way her mouth moves has still been the best way that resonates with the video, like captures the words. So as you can see here, it's taking its time, applying one avatar, 36%. So that's another thing to be mindful of is the time it takes it could be due to your internet it could be due to your computer it could be due to various reasons so now let's play and see welcome to CapCut biz media let's create something amazing to i did not delete 
CapCut. So let's go back here, make your edits, delete CapCut. I like the way she said BizCraw Media, though, I must say. That's pretty cool. Like, look at that. All right, let's do that again. So I'm going to come in here, and then let's see it's still applying 36 percent and there are other characters here as you see to the left there's just so much that you could do like that is just so awesome so many characters from so many places all around the world okay it's been applied now so now we have welcome to bizcrown media let's create something amazing and let's hit play welcome to bizcrown media let's create something amazing together this is really cool. I like I like that. I like that. All right, I'm just randomly going to pick somebody else here again and see. Let's pick this guy, Derek, in the kitchen. Derek's cooking, man. All right, let's see what Derek's going to say. Let's see if Derek is on point. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. I'm not too sure. Man. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. That's not bad. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. Welcome to CapCut Commerce not bad. Pro. Let's create something amazing together. Welcome to BizCrown Media. Let's create something amazing together. That's much Welcome better. To Pro. Let's create something amazing together. I mean, she's even louder, man. So what you're going to do now is once you've picked your avatar, I'm going to pick this avatar here. And I let me see if I can find her name. And remember, that's Asha in front of the dressing table. All right. So we're going to delete Derek. Very simple. You could right click and hit delete, or you could just hit delete on your keyboard. Nadia, thank you for being the first person there. And Jabari in the living room, all gone. So now we now have Asha in front of the dressing room. Now, if you want to make edits to this, there are various ways we could do it. So let's say we are going to post a 9 by 16, which is maybe on TikTok or a YouTube short. This is what we're going to use. Let's say we're creating a YouTube video. It's very simple. All you got to do is come to the ratio right here, original aspect ratio, and just change it. See, 16 and 9, and that's YouTube right there. So just so you know, there are many ways that you could go about this. It's just not the 9 by 16. So we're going to go by to the 9 by 16 and look at the various things that we could do over here. All right, so the first one is we can remove the background. So I'm going to just simply click that and see what it does. It removes the background. And how then can I change the color of this background? Because that's not looking too good. I think I could just come to the right here, select background, and any color I pick changes it, as you can see right there. So that's awesome. And I then can move Asha around in so many ways. And you also can pick textures. So let's go, like, these are different ones. So look at that. That actually matches her clothes. So there are different ones that you could use there. So, and that applies. And right there, you get that. And so we can actually enlarge this so we can see her better. There we go. So there you go. We have Asha there. Now, you can also add an overlay, which is you can add any other picture that you want that comes on top of there. That's up to you. But we're mostly focused on the avatar here. And then to fit screen. But, you know, we made that adjustment. But that's how you could fit it to the screen. I'm going to go back there. And then you can also add overlays, whether to the bottom right, to the bottom left, top left, and top right. But that's how you can simply edit your avatar here. Now, let's go back here and start this over. Welcome to BizCrown Media. Let's create something amazing together. So see Welcome that? Welcome to BizCrown Media. Let's create something amazing. So now we have it. We have our avatar. We've modified the background. We could change the format. We can choose any other ones here. And then if you notice here, going to the right, I'm going to go to the right here. We have the appearance of the avatars again here. So I could totally, again, change it and see what happens. Look at that. So in this instance, I am changing this avatar that we had here. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing. So obviously, I'm going to have to change back the text, but... That's how you can also change. You could go in there and make that change apart from just being in here. When you go in here, it changes the current file that you're in. When you're over here, it adds another one. That's the difference. So as you can see here, we have together. Welcome to CapCut Commerce Pro. Let's create something amazing together. Yep. All right. So we're going to delete that now because we have our file that we have here. So that's how you can customize your avatar pretty much in CapCut. And when you're all done, you can also go into your elements to add any other thing that you want. Let's say you wanted to add a sticker in there. You can add your sticker. Let's put our sticker in here. As you can see, that's the sticker there. So there's still a lot of things that you could do in here, just so you know. 
Media, let's create something amazing together. Many things, it's simply... Crown Media, let's create something amazing. Simply the same way that you can make all your edits. And if you want to go back to Avatar, you just simply go back to Avatar there. Now, we have this over here and we have our avatar and when we are done and satisfied with it after we've made all our edits you can simply go to export over here now keep in mind you can also auto caption it here where it'll generate the caption so i think that's kind of cool too so let's not forget that you know it says welcome welcome to bizcrown media let's create something amazing together that's the captions right there just by auto captioning so these are the very amazing ways that you can modify your avatar to make it say exactly what you want. But again, I will go back to the fact that make sure that you are picking the one that, you know, the avatar pretty much matches what you want to say. In this instance, Asha is saying it. If you look at her lips and her mouth, it matches exactly the words. And I think that's important. So you have a host of them to look through here for that to happen and look for the one that matches your brand. And I could tell you that it seems like they keep adding them too. So, well, I hope this was helpful. If it is, fellow cap cutters, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and then you can always get access to helpful content that we create. Till next time, take care.